Hey everybody, I'm Ryan Cost in Huntington, West Virginia at Marshall University. In our first in-season Cost on campus, we take a look at the ashes to glory tale of Marshall football. Ask typical college football fans what they know about the thundering herd, and you're probably sure to hear names like Moss, Pennington, and Leftwich. But the story truly begins just off a of Huntington Airport runway in 1970. All the strides that they had made to get that program back on top, I mean, just devastated by the plane crash. Miraculously, the herd fielded a team in 1971, and slowly the turnaround began, culminating with a pair of 1AA championships and an undefeated season shortly after a successful move to D1A. One for the record books, Randy Moss. And they went through this just meteoric rise in the late 90s where they were, uh, they, they were just, uh, you know, wins were commonplace almost. So it, it's been a, a, an amazing climb from 1970 to where they are now. The story sounds like it's straight out of Hollywood, and now it is. Warner Brothers came to town last spring to shoot We Are Marshall, a film starring Matthew McConaughey that pays tribute to those who kept the herd thundering in 1971. I think they got a feel for what the crash meant to this community and what it still means. And um, from what I've heard and what I've seen, they've done a, a marvelous job of trying to stick to the real story and, and to tell what really is a great football story. It's a personal story for Morehouse, whose dad, Gene, was the team's radio announcer in 1970 and was killed in that crash. In 1996, I had the opportunity to do the games on television, the Marshall football games that would be televised. They offered me the chance to almost follow in dad's footsteps, so I, I jumped at the opportunity. It was a huge deal for me and my family. 35 years after the crash, current coaches and players are still mindful of how far the program has come. I sat through all those lean years in the 70s and those guys were my heroes and now to be back here as the head coach and all the success we've had is just a very humbling experience. This fountain at the heart of campus stands as a tribute to those who lost their lives establishing Marshall's football tradition. A tradition that will continue to thrive this fall. In Huntington, West Virginia, I'm Ryan Cost on campus reporting for the Palestra.